dear viewers welcome to our channel gvs bank academy today i am going to discuss about paper number 3 cib advanced business and financial management this is the new paper introduced in the cib these are the important questions for revision part 3 we are uploading discussing today you are providing coaching for october 2023 jeb examinations classes are commencing from first week of june 23 and for revision classes for cib june 23 are also in progress interested members are requested to contact on this number <coughs> question number 1 cross border acquisitions cross border acquisitions means one <coughs> acquisition of one company in another country so another con another country companies are acquisition in indian so in one in inbound acquisition means other country companies are acquiring companies in india otherwise outbound means our indian companies are acquiring companies outside india that is called outbound acquisition or inbound acquisition this is called cross border one country to another country to cvp cost volume profit also called as marginal costing cvp cost volume profit analysis or marginal costing is a good tool to assess the impact of changes in price changes in price how it is going to affect change in volume how it is going to affect change in variable cost how it is going to affect profitability change in fixed cost how it is going to affect the break even point price change in volume means number of units product produced variable cost which changes according to production fixed cost these are depreciation rent salaries interest on term loan these are fixed costs variable cost raw material cost power and pl wages these are variable which vary according to number of units production smart smart is a acronym that stands for specific s for specific m for measurable a for achievable r for realistic and i and t for timely s for specific m for measurable a for achievable r for, for realistic and timely t for definition of synergy in a merger or acquisition synergy after merging of two companies two organizations what is the benefit synergy means how it is the outcome one company is going to merge 1 plus 1 is equal more than 2 that is normally one company plus another company merging that is more than 2 means because of the merger of two companies whatever the benefit they are individually getting after merger that is definitely more than the benefit which they are getting individual companies that is called synergy in operations after merger and acquisition question number 5 traditional methods of control control the traditional method old methods personal observation break even analysis means no profit no loss analysis taking statistical reports from various departments and budgetary controls these are the old traditional methods of control personal observations break even analysis statistical reports budgetary control traditional what are the modern methods or techniques in of control opposite return on investment return on investment return on total investment take investment here capital employed you have to take capital employed financial statement analysis and ratio analysis financial statement analysis and ratio analysis responsibility account each department is responsible for their 
accounting system responsibility accounting who is responsible pert program evolution and review technique in project completion evolution te techniques pert program evolution and review techniques cpm critical critical path method cpm critical path method and ms management information system and finally management audit of the company how the management is doing overall functioning that is these are the modern techniques of control new things are pert program evolution review technique critical path method and management audit these are the new remaining is okay question number 7 certainty equivalent approach is equal what is meant by certainty equivalent guaranteed return from an investment you are getting some guaranteed return from investment after adjusting the certainty equivalent from the return we are adjusting to certainty equivalent coefficient after that we are calculating the return that is called guaranteed return from an investment after adjusting certainty equivalent coefficient question number 7 is over <coughs> eighth three primary facets of stopping three primary sides facets means sides of stopping recruitment selection training three primary sides of stopping recruitment selection and training ninth question reverse merger merger normally reverse merger when a smaller company and a unlisted company acquiring a bigger company and a listed company smaller and unlisted company acquiring bigger company that to listed company in the stock exchanges that is called reverse merger ninth tenth creeping acquisition means creeping acquisition in the takeovers it will come sebi guidelines will take overs creeping acquisition no acquirer means any person who is acquiring the company together with other persons acting in their control is allowed to acquire more than 5% and up to 5% of holding in any financial year he can purchase every year 5% on the 31st march every year he can purchase acquire 5% of holding as on 31st march without complete giving the open offer in the paper publication without giving the open offer in the publication requirement if the acquirer existing holdings are between 15% and up to 75% suppose he is already crossed 15% of total paid up capital and holding up to 75% of paid up capital he can acquire how much every year 5% of paid up capital that paid up capital figure you have to see on 31st march without giving open offer so what is the meaning of this creeping acquisition without giving open offer the acquirer can purchase every year 5% of paid up capital if he is already having share capital 15% and above and up to 75% of paid up capital is there he can acquire every year so that is going to be creeping action is going to be stopped by reaching the 75% after reaching 75 he cannot purchase shares under creeping maximum 75% divestures 11th question divestures it is a opposite to merger divestures means opposite to merger the big company is becoming smaller asset base and it is going to lose control so opposite to mergers is called as divestures result in a smaller asset base the company bigger company is become smaller and it is going to lose the control what are the types of divestures in india normally to avoid the mergers they are selling part partial sell off they are selling the partial part of the company they are transferring the ownership partly 
they are demerging the company with others they are transferring if t convert means they are transferring for part of the equity to others and psu disinvestment all will comes under types of divestitions partial sell off transfer of ownership to others demerger merger means clubbing demerges means um, delinking equity carve out and psu disinvest india india is 103 Indian Accounting Standard India S One Zero Three deals with business combinations, mergers, business combinations. Accounting Standard Fourteen amalgamations, mergers. Indian Accounting Standard One Zero Three business combinations, mergers. So for today, these are the thirteen questions I am discussing now. Thank you very much for extending support to our channel. Thank you very much for all.